effect in industrialization and the effect it has on the continent. The role of science and technology is to lead national development and to support socioeconomic activities. The priority areas that have been identified so far are development in electronics, information, communication, technology, and development of selected high technologies to lead the industrial structure and its adjustment. So today we're going to talk about everything around technologies, the role it has in the continent, the importance that people have to give to technology, and we have an expert with us in the studio to talk about this topic today. So if you're just tuning in, you're welcome. I present to you our panelists, the expert in technologies who is with us in the studio. We have Mr. Cedric Che Aze. Good afternoon. You're welcome to the program. Thank you so much for having me. Good afternoon. He's the CEO of Maxwell's Technology. We are glad having you in the studio with us. Thank you so much. Okay, let's start this edition by watching uh, this video, which talks about the importance of technology in the African continent, what some of the youths are trying to do in that aspect, and how they are impacting their society, which is a new trend in the world right now. COVID has really brought it more to the forelight is using online more as a platform to reach the rest of the world. We deal with innovation, digital skills, critical thinking and problem solving. And how we do this is by teaching children and adults how to code, how to create technology. But we focus mainly on women and girls. We digitize the whole uh, Zanzibar island and we have a building footprint of uh, around 500,000 buildings. You know, that's a very big task. Microtasking is basically breaking down a big task into smaller tasks that can be done by more people fast. It's very digital, everything is digital, so we just train you and then using like WhatsApp, give out tasks to people. And then payment, you know, you can do payment via mobile money. Depuis la pandémie, les magasins sont fermés. Pendant que l'atelier, le magasin était fermé, j'ai eu l'idée de lancer ou de développer un site en ligne pour pouvoir introduire les produits qu'on avait déjà. Le site en ligne ou le magasin en ligne permet à ce que nos clients de loin ou de près peuvent toujours accéder à ce qu'on a. Because uh, retail has been so fragmented, what has ended up happening is that uh, farming has also ended up being very, very fragmented. So you're having a lot of inefficiency on both sides of uh, the chain, and that leads to a lot of uh, wastage. So for us, that has been a huge challenge. We've used technology to try overcome some of those uh, challenges. And the key thing is, uh, you know, how do you use technology to solve the most basic problems that we have on the continent? Because every problem that you see around you is an opportunity waiting to turn into a business. Technologies and it's important in business and the available opportunities. We know it's a very broad topic because uh, it's like the 21st century has a lot to do with technologies. And now, our days in particular, we are in 2023. Is there anything that anybody can actually do without technology? Mm. Good question. Yeah, but th there is a lot people can actually do without technology. So, so much. I but think is it going to be as effective as if you use any form of technology? To be honest, technology is a very good enhancer for, mm -hmm. for a lot of things. However, this question is extremely important because it uh, already makes me draw our attention to the fact that technology is not really a replacement of our life. Okay. It's not a replacement of our livelihood and everything we meet in nature, in life and everything. 
anybody who is extremely uh, deeply embedded in technology is going to understand that technology is just a tool to be able to enhance everything which we are. At the end of the day, we are humans. At the end of the day, we are on a planet. At the end of the day, nature is still there. There is a lot. Technology comes to enhance these things. If we consider technology like some, uh, something which is coming to replace all of this, we could um, be tempted to think that we, couldn't, we can't do anything without technology. Meanwhile, on the other hand, uh, if you get to the health sector, you're going to see a lot of doctors who are going to advise you to do therapy by actually distancing yourself from technology. Mm -hmm. You're actually going to see fields where um, you could actually uh, enhance, you could actually enhance productivity, creativity by actually uh, not aligning yourself so much with technology. So there's a lot we can do without technology. Okay, let's talk about business in Africa. And we know that business is trending, it is changing. You need to be able to move all the time because there are new things which come in day in, day out. Now, looking at the sphere in Africa and how business is growing, what is the importance of technology in this aspect? Very vital, extremely vital. Uh, currently, Africa is uh, on a very emergent wave. And uh, the greatest thing which has enhanced this emergence is technology. We know of the, we've just uh, moved from the industrial age and uh, most of the countries which are superpowers today, they took advantage of the industrial revolution to be able to grow to the level where they were. Mm -hmm. Before that, we had the agrarian revolution and the countries which grew tremendously during that time were those who took advantage of agriculture. It's amazing that Africa is actually getting into technology currently because we are in a technological revolution era. And if we want to be able to compete, business being one of the primary uh, domains where if we have to compete with the rest of the world, we have to be very much invested in. If we really need to compete in terms of business, technology will enhance that. So even though, even if technology uh, cannot replace our lives, technology is possibly the greatest enhancer for everything within our lives. For everything within business that we are going to be executing, technology is important. Mm -hmm. uh, not least of which is, let's take, um, randomly uh everybody who's getting into business you must before you even begin your business let's talk about the state in which africa is we are having a lot of startups coming up in the continent if we could leverage technology just at the level of uh, market analysis it's going to give us a tremendous edge over uh, the rest of the world because the technologies which are coming to africa to solve uh, african problems is going to be difficult for anybody who does not have the data of what's happening in the African continent mm -hmm. to be able to use that. And data, almost every source of data is going to be tremendously enhanced by technology. So we embracing this is going to be tremendously a huge booster for our business sector here in Africa. 